London slang was recorded in the ends, it was set in the ends. Everything about the Bumba Clark video is in the ends. Everybody can make their own forced versions of London slang in it, but they ain't ever gonna be like mine, so I really couldn't give a shit. Yo, obviously, hold tight my dons, hold tight my like fucking leaves in it. Yeah, done no, hold tight tunnel. Yeah, tunnel. A lot of people didn't understand what I meant by that, but it says it in the fucking sentence. Let me explain. Basically, you know when man them come on the camera and they're talking a bag of shit, they're all saying hold tight this person and hold tight that person. That's what I was doing, like hold tight leaves and tunnel. Who, who's actually called that? So basically, I was just there taking the piss. Aye, she's a J bag, you know. A J bag in London means like a scat, a hoe, a fot, a whore. Also, the reason why people say J bag is because you know girls hold bags, is that they're holding all that dick in the bag, I'm chatting shit, but it, it makes sense right, meet me by the corner, yeah by the corner, by the corner, by the corner, by the corner, yeah that corner, yeah that corner, say nothing fam, a lot of people didn't understand the scene as well, but it does explain its fucking self, meet me by the corner, and say nothing means, say nothing, can it? get off the phone now, the conversation's done, swear down fam, if that was me, man wouldn't have it fam, I would have sparked him, you get me? Swear down means, are you serious? And sparked means like, retaliate. So whether that's violence or just chatting shit like, bun you, dickhead. Uh, what that scene represents is like, you know when you hear some bullshit from your friend and you're sitting there thinking, you know if that was me, yeah, I would have done something else. Man really would have retaliated. So yeah, that's what that shit means. Only real bad man sat at the back of the bus. Done no. Um... That scene sort of explains itself. Only real bad man sit at the back of the bus. Done no. Fuck school, fuck education. I'm doing my own thing. I'm making my own money. Everyone's been through that situation whether you're not even from England or whatever. You can be from anywhere. You're at that stage where you're thinking education is long. I just want to drop out. And that usually results to ended up in jail or debt. But I'm not gonna lie, some people do become millionaires once they drop out of school because they create their own business or some shit. Not everything is negative in the end. But um, stay in school innit? Don't know. Obviously, don't get it twisted. I'm a top baller right here, you know? Just cause I dress in the same clothes every day, that does not mean I'm a bro cute. Or what? You gotta go. A hey, big man, have you got 10p? Let me break this down in it. So a lot of man them love to start off their sentences with obviously, I don't understand why because what they're saying is not fucking obvious. But I do catch myself saying that shit certain times. I'm a top baller right here, which means I get a lot of money. The other bits in that scene obviously explains itself, but overall what that I was trying to say is, you know the man them that claim they get a lot of money like they're all ballers and shit, but then they're the same donnies to be asking you for money. Like something doesn't add up, it explained that shit. 